Hell yeah, what's up guys? It's Chris Pike. My friends call me Big C. I'm back in action today. I'm going to show you how to record gameplay footage for free. Yep, in 2022, recording gameplay footage, uh, particularly PC footage, is easier than ever. So for those of you that are new to YouTube and new to video editing and recording, or if you're thinking about becoming a YouTuber or a gaming YouTuber because you know somebody that's really, really good at it and you think you can do it too, I'm here to tell you right now, you can. It's easier than ever, and I'm going to show you how to do it step by step. Recording footage, recording audio, video editing, all using free software. It's pretty wild. Let's get going. The first step, you want to record some gameplay footage, is to go to obsproject.com like I've done here. Once you get there, you're going to see a few options. What we're looking for is OBS Studio. And in particular, we're going to download the Windows version because I'm using a PC. But if you're on a Mac or a Linux, go ahead and use that. But Windows, left click on it, and you're going to see that it starts the automatic download of OBS Studio. Now, here's the thing. I've already installed it on my program or on my, <laughs> on my computer. It, the program's already installed, pardon me. So if I left click on it, it'll just basically say in a few seconds here that it's already installed and already running. So just trust me. This is the step you want to click next, 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 and presto, there we go. It will be installed. Once you have it installed, and it's very, very simple, now let's open it. Here we go. This is OBS Studio, and this is what it's going to look like when you first open the, or when you first pop the hatch. The first step you want to do is we're going to go ahead and just make a few quick tweaks so that we get the settings right, so we're recording and it's going to be correct. Left click on settings over here under controls, like I have done, and then let's just quickly go down and look at a few important ones. The first one I want to look at is video. You're going to see here base canvas resolution and output scaled resolution. Sounds kind of tricky. It's not. Basically, you just want to make sure that this number here, 1920 by 1080, because I'm on my laptop, is the same as your monitor. That's it. In 99 out of 100 times, it will be. You can also output it into a different file size. If you have very small hard drive, you can drop it down to 1280 by 720. But 1920 by 1080 is usually the one you want to go with. Real quickly here, if you want to look at audio, you're going to see here a few options. I've got desktop audio set to default. Uh, and if you want to, you can set it to speakers or headphones or whatever you have set in there. But again, I've just gone ahead and set it to default. The last one we're going to look at is the advanced section here. This is the only one that you really want to be careful with. You're going to see a few things, but you're going to see something that says automatically remux. Remux is a word, apparently, to MP4. Left click on that and make sure the check mark is selected. Why? Because here's the thing. Under video, you're going to see here that it records. I actually won't see it right here, but what happens is under video, you're going to be recording it as a FLV or a MKV file, but we don't want that. We want an MP4 to be remixed. So just make sure that this is, collect, is selected automatically remux to mp4 left click on apply and then presto those settings are going to be set all right now once that's done left click on ok and you're going to see here two other things that i want to show you the first one here is when i'm talking you'll see that it is recording my audio this is how you can see that in the bar here so if you want to record your gameplay footage but you don't want to pick up your microphone you can just left click on that little sound icon. If you don't want to pick up desktop audio, which is the gameplay footage uh, or the audio in the game, which is very unlikely, but if you don't, you can also left click on that as well. Okay, now the final steps. Here we go. You're almost there. You with me? Good. You're going to see under sources here, you've got a few options, but what you want to do is you notice we're not recording anything. It's a black screen. Left click on this plus and then select display capture now i'm going to go ahead and just click on ok and it's going to create display capture the capture method is automatic and it, we've selected the display one if you have multiple monitors you can go ahead and select that and select a second monitor left click on ok and now you're going to see the mirroring skull crazy enter the dragon stuff when bruce lee was in front of all those mirrors now okay i'm older than you guys sorry about that um but that's what you're going to see this is not something to worry about nothing to panic over just go ahead and now move over to the control section and then underneath it you're going to see start recording when you left click on that it's going to record your screen so let's go ahead and load up steam i'm just going to load it here let's see steam 
and let's play whatever the hell game I got just so you guys can see that it works and I'm not just talking nonsense all right so I don't know let's say what do you want to play Final Fantasy Shit. no it's not installed uh, Valheim that whatever okay good we're gonna play it and now when I'm talking to you guys you're gonna see this footage being recorded so I'm gonna go back over to the OBS studio and I'm going to left click on start recording. Let's get going and then you're going to see what happens and then that'll be the end of it. Left click on start recording. And here we are. We're talking and it should be recording that. Yeah, it will be. And then quit. It's basically what's happening is it's recording the stream. So it's recording whatever I see on my screen, the display capture. And when I'm done, I hit stop recording. And that is literally all there is to it. If you know those simple steps, you can now record any gameplay footage and become a YouTuber and start making your gameplay. The next video, I'm going to show you how to mix and edit it inside HitFilm Express again for free. Thanks for watching. Ton more stuff coming up. Stay tuned.